Love, Episode 6, The Reveal. In the morning, James goes straight to the meeting with Jennifer, the manager of the Human Resources Department, to tell her about the romantic relationship between John and Rachel. Hey James, how are you? And how are things over in the financial analyst world of the company? Things are running great. Numbers are up across the board and we have a great team. Have a new hire or something? That's the only reason you ever come this way. Unfortunately, I'm here to report an ethics violation in my department. Wow, sorry you have to be the whistleblower in this situation. Let me pull out a violations form so we can make sure this gets documented correctly. Okay, thanks Jennifer. Okay, first, who is the employee and what was their violation? Actually, there's two employees and they violated our newest code against dating in the workplace. That's a tough one. Who are they? It's John and a semi-new hire, Rachel. John? Like your manager John? Yes, like my very close friend John. Wow, well this must be tough on you. You made the right decision though because our company takes our code of ethics very seriously. Let's finish filing this report together, and I will handle the rest of the situation by following the human resources policies and procedures. Thank you, Jennifer. I really appreciate the support and help. This is tough, and I hope this doesn't ruin John and my friendship. After filing the form, James leaves and heads to work. Jennifer calls down both John and Rachel to the office to discuss this unethical romantic relationship. I have a feeling you both know why we are all here. I have a feeling. We knew it would not be a secret for too long. We also understand the severity of our violation. Because your level of seniority in the company, John, we have decided to be light on your punishment. And you have to be careful because you are under a microscope from now on. You don't get a second chance. I understand. I'll be apologizing to my department as soon as I can. Rachel, your punishment while more severe, is still very light. You will have to switch departments, and you will also be under a microscope with no second chances. Thank you, Jennifer. I completely understand. Do you guys have any other questions for me? No, no thank, thank you. you. Three days later. Rachel finds position in the billing department that she switches to. John calls a meeting to apologize to his team. I am sincerely sorry for my unethical actions on our newest code of ethics. Sometimes when you find the right person, you just can't change that. However, I am very proud of my close friend James for making the right decision and going to human resources on this situation. I will never break the code of ethics ever again. If someone else does, it should be reported to Jennifer exactly like James did. Because of his great decision, he is being promoted to assistant manager of our team. Congratulations, James. Yay! Woo-woo! Even though Rachel and John are now in separate departments, it doesn't separate the romantic relationship as they are still very happily seeing each other. See, bad situations can still end happily ever after as long as you make the right ethical decision.